confrontation has erupted outside state parliament with protesters attacking Qatar's Australian party. Controversial Senator Fraser Anning joined the party for one final dig at the Premier before their dumped staff finish up tomorrow. Tegan George reports. Free speech on full display outside the Queensland Parliament. You disgusting racist worms. Lucky you got the cameras around, mate. The member for Hill, on the other hand, may be not so lucky. The city socialists and country MPs clashed. Muslims are welcome, racists are not. Can you talk to me? The chants from the socialist alternative drowned out Catter's Australian Party. <laughs> which was there to condemn the Premier for axing its four extra staff over Federal Senator Fraser Anning's controversial maiden speech. You are a disgrace. You are absolutely a disgrace. There's a worker there who's lost his job. Why don't you help him? You help him. The man who sparked the entire saga stood back but won't stand down. Bowing down to a, you know, a black male like that? Absolutely not. This is a a blatant attack on freedom of speech. He's written a formal complaint to the President of the Senate querying whether the Premier has breached the Parliamentary Privileges Act. We're not moving our ground at all. Our vote just went straight through the floor. Use this opportunity to thank all those people out in the Queensland, the flood of support and the uh, financial assistance uh, those generous gifts, donations that have come in. The four workers will likely take their case to the Fair Work Commission. They don't blame Catter MPs for not apologising. They think it's the Premier who should be saying sorry. No, no, I fully support the KP stance 100%. I don't, I don't think they should be apologising. Their last day is tomorrow. Tegan George, 10 Eyewitness News.